Hey editor, Shungni here. In this video, we are going to show you how to make backgrounds inside of DaVinci Resolve, showing you uh, several easy ways to get them, but also one animated. So first, we have to show you how to get to a normal solid background. So for that, we go to our edit tab. So we're here in edit. We go to effects and we actually go to the toolbox here and we choose generators so here we see solid color so select and drag it onto your timeline so now you have a solid color so it starts with a solid black you go to inspector here on top and then choose generator and then we have color double click on there we have this color circle here so it's normally on black we drag this all the way to white and now we can choose any color that we want as our solid color background so just a slightly darker blue here okay so now to add a bit of more interesting instead of being just a single solid color i want to add a vignette however it uh, doesn't really directly uh, put or be usable on here so if we go to our filters here and then resolve effects we can go all the way down and we will find vignette or we can search here for vignette so vignette if we try to drag it on here it doesn't work so to actually allow you to work with the vignette on a solid color we have to make it into a new compound clip so just right mouse click on the solid color choose new compound clip and then you can give it a name or just click create now we can just drag and drop the vignette onto the compound clip we can go to the inspector here and then choose effects and then we can change the parameters of the vignette so we can change events to change also more things but let's keep it basic just add more softness and it gives us a nice simple more interesting background for your title card or intro now to a bit more interesting like what we have here at the start we can go to generators let's actually remove this search here get our four color gradient and drag and drop this here get this really funky effect here now click onto the four color gradient and we basically have these four colors we can adjust so we change them to blue here this bright to a darker blue this also to a blue this one to a darker blue however in this uh, effect we can't really animate them only difference is with this uh, center XY you can see we can make it a gradient top to bottom or gradient left to right so it's not really for uh, animation even though you can add a uh, keyframe for it but yeah it's not really that great of an animation so to animate it we have here in generators also animated uh, yeah backgrounds we can choose from so we have this wavy form with this gradient noise with this paper which doesn't really see much movement and then we have this textured background so we choose the noise gradient drag and drop onto your timeline now click on it and then we have here noise gradient and we can actually choose versions here so it has different kind of effects already built in so this is kind of like an anime effect so back to version 1 and then we can choose the gradient and a simple way without more hassle we can choose the type of gradient and choose to two color so we just have to adjust it more easily so for type color one we choose a lighter blue or like this 
and then uh, the one which is a much darker blue and then we change to the control and we can change the skill so it's smaller or bigger so we want a little bit more bigger and we have this effect of a slightly moving background without being too boring or too much things happening in the background you can also change the speed of it and everything else just play around with the parameters here so that was it how to make several different kinds of easy uh, clean backgrounds in uh, DaVinci Resolve hope you found this an interesting video if you want to see more please hit the subscribe button if you want to see certain effects please comment them in the comment section here below and I'll see you in the next video bye bye